Hi YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today we have Ryan. This video is so special and so important to us. It is our new pugs journey. So we filmed all of these clips and we're gonna put them all in this video and we're just gonna react to them and you'll finally get to meet him. It's such a big deal. We've been wanting this pug for over five years. The name was picked out for over five years, which you guys will find out the name if you continue watching the video. And he's here right now. He's just sleeping. Sleep he's sleeping. Yeah, he's sleeping right now. But when he wakes up, which would be in a bit, probably we'll like show you him live. But I have my laptop here. I have all the footage edited from the past couple weeks, maybe three weeks of just meeting him, bringing him home. And we're gonna go through the video. So sit back and watch cute pug footage. Yes. All right. Pudgy. Five a couple times. Hey, what the hell was that? Over the past week. Oh, we're stupid shit. Not good. Ryan, what are we doing? We are driving. Where? <laughs> to a house. What does the house have inside of it? I can't even look at the camera. I feel sick. Why? You never been through this before. That's why. I don't remember feeling this anxious. About getting yeah, because now it's just stupid. Not stupid, <laughs> but stupid to feel that way. Because it's just a dog. No, he's a family member. Yeah, but it's not, you know what I mean? It's not like a real baby. He is a real baby. Dog. <laughs> we might be adding someone to the family. Oh my god. If we so don't get in a car accident first. This is so random. This was not supposed to happen until another six months. Think, right? And what people say me and Ryan live? Where are we going? Oh, <laughs> we're going. <laughs> Hold on. Again. So this is the first day where we actually went to go see this pug. So what had happened was my mom and I we were watching The Bachelor, and she's the one who actually brought up getting him. And I was like, "You want another dog in your house?" Like I never. She's not a dog person, like ever. All these dogs that have ever lived here are because of me. Only one dog belongs to her which is Stardust but the other three have been, all been mine and she's never really cared for them but for some reason she loves this one and she brought it up and next thing you know we were driving there to go see this pug and there's never pugs like this in Las Vegas so as soon as we saw that it was near Ryan's house and it was a good like a really good price of course we had to go see it but I knew deep down that like we were gonna get it because like you're gonna fall in love as soon as you see a puppy right but I was like very nervous, I was very scared, I didn't know, because I wasn't ready. We were supposed to get this pug in May for Pudgy's birthday. Anyways, we're gonna go see a special someone. <laughs> I don't know what's gonna happen. I have a question for you both then. Mm. Would you guys get it for me for my birthday? Yeah. <laughs> my mom, she says <laughs> yeah right away. Would you? Because I would change my mind a little bit because I'm, I'm more hesitant. I was thinking of May, but I'm not going to be going on that vacation anymore, Ryan. You want to think about it? I vacation like now. It's not good either. Not fun. Everyone's, everywhere's slow. I'm just saying because it's either... Get the dog better and vacation like now. You safe too. But you think they're putting you on the spot. Would you get it for me for my birthday with yeah. my mom? I think about it. You think about it? Okay. Technically, it would be your, a gift to you, too. Okay. <laughs> this is a boy. Yeah, You're this was a boy. Cute. That's a boy. Yeah. Okay. This is... What's her name? Snuffles. Snuffles? Snuffles. Snuffles this from... This is Snuffles, which is our pug's mom. She's the cutest thing. She has the big bug eyes. And, yeah. And we'll, I'll insert a picture of his dad because I didn't get a video of him, I don't think. Dexter. Dexter. Oh, yeah, there's, oh, there's Dexter. <laughs> See, look at it. Oh, How okay. He's built like that. You think he's really skinny? That's yeah. super skinny. Yeah. He has very thin hips. And Pudgy doesn't? No. Oh my god. Are pugs gonna be skinny? What? So now we had to decide on what puppy we wanted permanently, I guess. Like, I guess it was already, we're gonna get this pug. So there is a choice out of three boys. We always wanted a boy. And there was like this big one, a very small one, and then one that was like in between. My mom really wanted the small one, but we wanted to think for ourselves without any bias. So we literally kicked her out of the room. I was like, get out. 
like let us choose because she was like you have to pick the little one it was like annoying and so we took our time we played with all of them and then we thought of a decision mom guess what which one the one you wanted no. <laughs> that's one this is the one you wanted keep that <laughs> Is it good? Aren't you excited? Good job. Exciting. Oh yeah. my God, it's, so small. it's so cute. You guys don't have to listen to me. I think I can. Well, we wanted to just talk without you first to make a final decision so there wasn't any bias, but okay. we right. for sure want this because little guy. They're going to go big, 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 but it's not going to be Here, that much. We ended up picking the one she wanted, the very small one, which was kind of scary because we like the bigger punks, you know, but whatever. We picked him because of his face. Did, was there like a point for you why you picked him? For me, it's his face. It's he looks like pudgy on the face. Yeah. He's not ready to go home yet, but on the 28th, maybe. <laughs> mm, so cute, look at the face. He's tired. Yeah. <laughs> He's so cute. I am happy he broke out of his shell because he didn't really show any personality. I think he likes it here more because of all the freedom he has. Yeah. But during when we met him, he was very mellow. Yeah, he didn't, he didn't have any kind of personality. <laughs> he was very sleepy though when we first met him. We wish we could take your little potato shell home today, but we can't. He was so little. He's already grown a bit. Not even a bit. Uh, and so right here, this cat comes up, and I love cats. <laughs> I didn't care. You could clearly tell I've you never did seen not a cat look like this. that. Yeah, it's a pretty cat. That looks so but I did cool. not care. I don't even know what that color is. It's it looks like gray. ashy and cream. Yeah. But it's like a dark, it's more dark than a cream. I'm, I don't, can't even describe what that color is. It's like a tan. Kind of looks like on oh, my jacket. Boring! Like a gold? Well, maybe? you should have adopted the cat then. I don't know. I don't know. I like fluffy cats. <laughs> like, like Binksy. Binksy? That's like Binksy, but unique color. Yeah. I can't believe that's numbers. Alright. Can you get them for me? Yes. Uh, really? Yeah, sure. It's a birthday gift? <laughs> Okay. Aww. Yeah, my birthday is next month, so they're gonna they're gonna get him for me. Okay. <laughs> Even though we're gonna be sharing him, but yeah. How do I go? This is the best birthday gift ever. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. What did you think the name was? Juicy. Juicy. Where did Juicy come from? I don't know. Okay, we're gonna reveal the name now. So if you made it this far, you're gonna hear it in this next clip. Yes. We're gonna say the name in three, two, meet you two. Okay, so I'll say three, two, one, and then we both say it. Okay. Okay, three, two, one. Numbers. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> no idea what that is. <laughs> you know, my English not good. How are we gonna say it? You can say nubs. Num? Num, that's water. <laughs> sure. Numbers. Numbers. What does it mean, numbers? We made it up. Everyone asks us what it means and we don't know. We just made it up. Like, what's a number is we don't know. We like to say it's the pug paws. Like the nubs and numbers. Nubs and pudge. There's pudgy and now there's numbers. <laughs> Frame rate is so bad on the iPhone. Yeah. My God. Numbers. What's the middle name? I don't know. We forgot that. Yeah, his middle name is Bubbers. Bubbers. <laughs> so it's Numbers Bubbers Nielsen. Bubbers named after your fish, Bubby. Oh, I didn't know that. They both are black. Rip Bubby. <laughs> yeah. Do you have a picture of him? <laughs> yeah, a lot. So a lot. Yeah, I was happy to get that fish. I don't remember that many. Pictures. Yeah. And his, like, I don't remember that many memories of him. I he lived for like two we weeks. Like, oh, totally. two weeks? I thought it was like a day or two. Oh no. That's funny. But no, we had the middle name picked out, but it's been so long. So in the clip, it seemed like we didn't know a middle name, but we had Bubbers picked out for probably three years. Numbers, five years. It's been a long time in the making. We were waiting for the one. Two, one, action. Pudgy, we have some exciting news. We just got home from you know where. Oh, the audio cuts out. But I'm basically telling Pudgy I'm pregnant with his baby brother. Why's the audio cut out? I don't know, because I think I got a phone call, like a FaceTime or something, and it cut off the uh, thing. But I was telling Pudgy I am pregnant with his baby brother. <laughs> oh, this is when you tell your dad about him. Oh, uh, okay. 
said you asked me what's new in the world. I am getting a brand new puppy. For your house? Not for my house. It's gonna stay at Patia's house and when we move out it'll come with us. What kind of dog? It is a black baby pug. Interesting. What are you, you gonna name it? His name is gonna be Nubbers. Nubbers? Is your mom know? No, I haven't told her yet, so don't tell her. I'll, 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 I'll tell her. Yeah, I'll let her know. You say don't tell her. I say don't tell her, and he tells her. Who I know. Her? Like, he, he, like, literally, listen, he says, I will not tell her. Yeah, he tells her what the next day, and he shows her, he, <laughs> what he said, your daddy is like, I only showed her the picture of him. That's everything. I know. That was funny. We were going to surprise his family, but he, uh. Yeah. Her pudgy's gonna have a little brother. Well, make sure puppy pudgy still gets his love and respect. <laughs> Why did say respect? I will love pudgy forever. Alright, so smart. It's just honestly, we're getting it because I forgot. I forgot what I said, so I'm gonna see if I still have that same mindset. I think I just wanted it for Pudgy. I wanted him to have a brother. Yeah, I wanted I it want for Pudgy to too. The reason why fun. we got this pug this year versus the past five years was just right time, right pug, right place. But also because Pudgy was still young and we were doing so much with him. Like we were traveling with him. We took him to freaking San Diego. <laughs> and so that's going to be tough with two pugs now. I don't know how we're going to pull that off. But he's older now. Pudgy's going to turn eight this year. And... My mom's dog Stardust, he is not the playful type. He's like a little grumpy old grandpa. And Pudgy actually loves playing. So this cat, we were, honestly, it was like we were fostering this cat. We found this cat, long story. Anyways, this cat name, we named her Maki, came into our lives because we found her. And Pudgy and her had the best time together. But luckily, our friend from work day adopted her from us. And she's the best mom to her because we're not, well, I'm not really a cat person. He is. And so when she left, Pudgy went into depression mode. He was so sad. He didn't have anyone to play with anymore. Sardis isn't going to play. He never really has with him. And so that got me thinking, like, Pudgy needs the little brother now. And we made it happen. One, it's a pug. Two, I really want Pudgy to have a little brother. He needs that, especially a couple years from now. When we're moved out and we're both working all day, I don't want him to be in the house by himself. Yeah. That's a good point. Fair enough. Fair enough. Did I mention he's a pug? You mentioned he was a pug. I like pugs. I love pugs. Pugs are the best breed. Here, I'm gonna send you a picture right now. Send me a picture. He's so cute. <laughs> that photo is such an iconic photo now. Like, that was his very first photo with us, and his face is perfect yeah. in the photo. Like, he looks so, so cute. He calls it the money shot. Yeah, I feel like the next, uh, <laughs> up until we got him, we just put that in each other's yeah. faces. And everyone else's face at work. We kept showing everyone that one photo. I think we were annoying about it. I think you showed, like, more people than I did. Yeah. Like, that's my new son. Mom? Yes. Yeah, he's adorable. Uh, did he zoom in on his face? Yeah. What do you think? Good choice. Thank you. Good choice. I know you guys will love him and take care of him. Yes. <laughs> he was he so small face. in that photo. Yeah. You'll see. He's not that small anymore. You'll see. Well, when he wakes up. It's later in the day, we're about to go to bed, but I thought, since it's so official now, we should write down the day we get to take him home. It's the same day you have to return your library books. Welcome. Well, why do you write a calendar? You keep a calendar, no one keeps a calendar. Women keep calendars. Two more days till numbers. Here. How excited are you? Tell them what you just told me two seconds ago. I said uh, tomorrow night, because we don't get him tomorrow, we get him the day after tomorrow. So tomorrow night, I'm not going to be able to sleep. I know. Me either. Look at you. You're thinking about your son. Mm -hmm. 
This is gonna be him. I'm gonna be holding him like a baby. I'm gonna rock him back and forth, and I'm gonna put him to sleep and go. You know. Now we're going into the day that we pick up numbers. It's January 28th. You're gonna see how excited but nervous I was. I don't know how were you feeling that day. I think I was just excited. Yeah. I don't remember feeling nervous. I was nervous because I was like, oh my god, how's this gonna go? Like pudgy, and I, I don't know. Today's the big day, pudgy. You're getting your little brother. <laughs> Bless you. Oh, aren't you excited? He's excited. Huh? Huh? Today we're getting a baby boy pug. I'm actually going to get ready hair and makeup. Like I'm gonna curl my hair for this pug. Just for pictures and stuff. Look at my shirt. My shirt is two pugs. One fawn one and one black one. And I wore that on purpose the night before because I was so excited to get nubbers. It's like pudgy nubbers on my shirt. Pudge and nubs. Pudge and nubs. Pudge and nubs. Right now, Ryan is setting up just extra things we need to get done before this dog comes. And I've been so nervous. I'm going to actually just start getting ready because it's 11 and we get him at 12. Honestly, yeah, there should be enough time. An hour, hair, makeup. But I've been nervous, but Ryan's been super excited. He could tell you himself. Babe, come here. I'm uh, excited on a scale from 1 to 10, definitely 11. Tell them how long we've been waiting for this. Five years-ish. Five freaking years. And it's happening. It's happening. We decided, we asked him. I'm like nervous, I don't know why. And he said he was ready. <laughs> Pudgy has no idea. I'm nervous, I don't know why. I just want it to all go well. I mean, there's not really much you can prepare for other than just get the house ready, which we did all day yesterday. We cleaned it, we got him all his stuff. He has everything he could ever need as a puppy. I've been watching videos left and right, even though he will be my fourth dog I raise, but it's been seven years since I raised the puppy because Pudgy is seven years old. And it's just, I don't know. I don't know guys. I'm nervous. I just want him to love his new home. Well, that's all I got for right now. We'll check in with future Patia and I'll do my hair and we'll see ya then. Now we're on our way to get numbers. We have this envelope because that's the money and yeah, that's we're on our way. And it's exciting, it's nerve wracking and they, he lives right by Ryan's house. It's so funny because yeah. it's not even far. Our baby is three minutes away. How are you feeling? Ready. You're ready to be a newly father? You ready for a puppy? Yes. Okay, guys, we're here. I'm going to switch over to iPhone, but this is the last time we'll be parents to one child. One child. <laughs> I'm so excited. I just want to go inside. I know. Okay, let's go inside. We're gonna take. Oh. I know. It's so exciting. I want to grab him right now. Well, grab him when he's revealed here. Okay. Oh, wait. <gasps> Those are his siblings. That's him. That's actually him. I swear. <laughs> you're kidding, right? I think he's the one in the cage. Uh -huh. So you're. <laughs> These are his siblings. How they get to be slow mo? They all look the same. They all look the same. Ooh. Are you sure it's not that one? Yeah, hold on. That one actually looks kind of different. They all look the same, I don't know. <laughs> They're so cute. I'm pretty sure Nervous is the one in the cage. <laughs> yeah, the purple, one. right? Yeah, but they did it. Oh, wait. I don't know if I filmed this before or after. <laughs> They're all spooty mm, eyes. The numbers. <laughs> They're so cute. Too much love. That's love. <laughs> that might be numbers. Oh, wait, no. Wait, it's purple. That's it. <laughs> Why is he in the cage? All right, Nub, say goodbye to your siblings. You can put him in one last time because we know he's the only boy without the collar. I just want him to say goodbye. Here you goodbye. Look at him. Look, he's looking at his eyes. You're the cutest. No way, we're going to take you home. Say goodbye. Oh, I'm gonna take you now. Let me take you. It's time to say goodbye to 
to your snuggies. <laughs> Why is it so tricky to get right now? Come here. Come here. I know you're excited. Is that the right one? Let's double check. <laughs> no. no. You are a girl. You guys all I think he's that one for two. There you go. Yeah. Okay. Come here. You're so small. That's everyone's like getting in the way of you. Let's go home. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You'll see him grow up on our Instagram. What are you going to name him? Numbers. Numbers. <laughs> Numbers. Telling people his name is so funny. Numbers. Nike. They're all big. Look at them. Look at this. <laughs> what? What? Look, he's so cute. Look, look, look. I know they're. Well, the girls are the biggest ones. It's like they're his size now. After a week. Nice. Numbers. He's coming up. Oh. <laughs> all right. Thank you. Food so shot record. <laughs> I want to cry. Well, you gave birth. I gave birth. <laughs> Let me hold you. Numbers, Bubbers, Nielsen. <laughs> That's your dad. I'm driving. He's right. a good driver. You're going to drive with him. And my mom doesn't drive, just so you know. So he's always the driver. He's always right there. <laughs> Is it even legal to have something this cute? Ah! He already has the cutest curly tail, guys. You're beautiful. He's not that nervous. Like, he's not shaking or anything. Yeah. <laughs> so cute. Look at what you're doing with your foot. You're already doing something like Pudgy would do. I can't wait for you to meet Pudgy. <laughs> I can't wait either. Oh, I love you so much already. You want to see our middle school? This is where we went to middle school. It's called Garside. That's our school. Know. That's my hair, mister. That's my hair. I don't ever let anyone lick or eat my hair, but I'll let you. They still had it. Pudgy has no idea. That's your blanket. I brought a little blankie for you. Why were the girls all so big? <laughs> they were jumbo pugs. Turns out that boy didn't get that big anyways, the bigger one, because they all look the same size. Yeah. Are you gonna have a white head or is that your skin? I love you. Alright, we're just gonna enjoy this moment with him in the car now. We're here! This is your home. For now. It's your home. So we're gonna go inside. He's gonna meet Pudgy right away arms. and Stardust. Why are you holding him and like that for? <laughs> he's he's, he's supposed to like, be really calm on the way home. And he was eating my hair the whole time. But he's such a good boy. His arms. <laughs> Alright, you ready to meet your big brother? It's a lot of oranges. <laughs> okay. Let's do it. That's it? That's all you guys are getting for this video. It's a cliffhanger. Okay. So for the next video, for sure, it's going to be when they meet, like the second they meet. I'm not going to spoil it. You guys will see for yourselves to so stick around. If you enjoy this video, so oh, wait, wait. we need to show him. Yeah, grab him. Grab him. Ah, grab our baby. Let's have numbers do the outro. It's his first outro. Ready? This is what he looks like now, guys. <laughs> that so funny. There he is. <laughs> <laughs> this bug. is our son, our newly son. Pudgy is here, and Pudgy still gets so much love, but he's so yeah. happy. Um, yeah. <laughs> you'll see Mr. Nump's here meeting his big brother in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, <laughs> you're so small. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe, and you'll get more numbers videos. We're probably gonna have a whole playlist. <laughs> Videos. Yeah, so we're probably gonna have a whole playlist of just his journey and him growing up and his first time getting a bath, his first time going to the park. There's lots of number videos coming and Pudgy will be in them as well. So if you love Pudgy, he'll be in there. But welcome our new baby to the family. I love you and I love you. Do you want to say anything? Here, hold them and you can do a little outro. I love all of you guys. Look at him. 
so exciting. Welcome to YouTube numbers. And he, they will have an Instagram, so Pudgy's always had the Pudgy Pudge Instagram. The username is going to change now, guys. It's going to be Pudge and Nubs, so follow Pudge it Nubs. if you haven't already. And follow the journey. Watch him grow up. Thank but, you so uh, much for watching. He's falling, falling asleep. Yeah, he's falling asleep. Kind of looks like uh, like Darth Vader with the helmet. Yeah, he looks like Darth Vader to us. <laughs> All right, well, thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video of Numbers Meaning Fudge. Bye, guys. Bye, bye. <laughs> you got your pasties out. Ooh. Your make, hands are cold. Let's, let's make another type of video. <laughs> I don't like being on this side. I'm never on this side. Trait. We're stupid. Why didn't we just move chairs? <laughs> <laughs> Something fun you would say. What? The lighting's good. Is that what you do when it's you get day. ready for a video? Well, I'm excited because the lighting's good today. Okay, we can start now. Hold on. I need my waters. I always need a water near me. If I'm ever famous and like I need to request something on a talk show, it's that I always need water. They already provide that, I think. Doing good on your own. How long has the mom been gone for? Who knows? I wanted to say goodbye to Scuffles. Sniffles. Oh, Snuffles. Snuffle. Oh, Snuffles. <laughs> we don't know her name. And then the dad's name is Dexter. Dexter. Oop. You sitting on something. Move your hand. Be alone.